Hello friends, hope you are doing well. So today's video topic is if you are unable to install your Windows 10 or Windows 11 on your laptop or desktop and you are getting this kind of error window, Windows cannot be installed to this disk. The selected disk is of the GPT partition style. So to fix this error, you have to convert your GPT partition to MBR. So let's fix it. First, cut this error window. Cut this window as well click on yes now click on this option repair your computer this will open the advanced option now click on troubleshoot then click on this option command prompt now you have to type few commands to convert your GPT partition to MBR so the first command will be disk part press enter now type the next command list space disk press enter so this command will show all the storage you have connected with your laptop or desktop so as you can see currently it is showing two hard drives two storage the first one is disk 0 so this is my uh, 240 GB internal hard drive I have in my laptop and the disk 1 is my USB pen drive which I am using so you have to select your internal hard drive so I have this hard drive of 240 GB and my disk number is 0 so you have to type the next command select disk then you have to type the disk number so the disk number is 0 so I have to type 0 then press enter now type the next command clean one important thing that in this process all the data in your hard drive will remove so please take the data backup if you have any important data in your hard drive press enter to run this command disk part succeed to cleaning the disk now type the next command convert space MBR so this command will convert your GPT partition to MBR press enter that's it disk part successfully converted the selected disk to MBR format that's it now cut this window after that turn off your PC and start the installation process again so let's start first I will turn off my PC now start the process again click on next click on install now and you can see this is my hard drive of 240 GB right now it is in unallocated space so select the hard drive then click on new to create a partition so I will create only a single partition click on apply then click on ok now click on next to process the solution and you can see the error has been removed this is all for the video thank you